Hello and welcome to the news update at 11. I am Nolene Ebel Ame. To boost agricultural productivity, strengthen the economy by creating opportunities in the real sectors of agriculture, manufacturing and construction, as well as provide urgent economic relief for Nigerians, President Bola Tinebu has approved the immediate rollout of the National Construction and Household Support Program to cover all geopolitical zones in the country. Under the program, the Sokoto Badagri Highway, the Trans Saharan, and the Lagos Calabar Coastal Highways are being accorded priority attention. These are parts of the resolutions of the National Economic Council meeting on Thursday governors to assiduously evacuate the fertilizer so that it can be of benefit to our teaming farmers. Our fertilizer is to be distributed free of charge. And in addition to that, we are looking at ways of essentially um, improving the mechanism by which payments are made so that they can be made quicker. The federal government and the African Union is working towards providing a sustainable single-digit loans for micro, small and medium enterprises to access affordable credit, which remains a major challenge facing Africa. Deputy Chief of Staff to the President, Ibrahim Hadeja, stated this at the opening of the 2024 International Dialogue organized by the federal government and African Union. It's not outside this continent, it's here. These facts provide us with the evidence that if MSMEs prosper, Nigeria prospers. And we can say the same about Africa and indeed the entire world. Senate has granted approval to extend the implementation of the capital components of the 2023 Appropriation Act and a supplementary to 31st December 2024. The amendment bills were given expeditious consideration as requested by President Tinubu on the first day of plenary after the Salah break. This extension was necessary to allow for the full implementation of the capital projects contained in the budget, particularly those infrastructure projects intended to improve commerce, address challenges with security, healthcare, and education and generally improve the lives and well-being of the Nigerian people. That's the update for now. Do join us at one for another update. I am Nolene Ebel Ame. Good morning.